Congratulations, you're a three. The late nights and weekends, the big deals closed, the mentoring, the cupcakes you baked for the team. How did that all become a three? In business, some things are naturally compressible. For instance, financial performance can be easily summarised into metrics like profit or earnings growth. And some things aren't. In so many cases, the pressure to build metrics around staff performance actually ends up removing information from the organisation. Think of it this way. You could choose between two divisions to invest in by using just a handful of financial metrics because financial performance is compressible. Now do this one. You know they're both threes, so who do you promote? When pressured like this, HR departments often do silly things to get metrics. Oversimplification. Trying to compress information that can't be easily summarised, like giving someone a promotability rating out of five. Substitution. Reporting on something that can't be easily measured by substituting something that can be. For instance, using absenteeism rates as a proxy for staff engagement. Ablegation. Failing to produce any real metrics that can be used for decision making, hiding behind the excuse, we're dealing with people, it's complicated. Normalisation. Using parlour statistics to create a false air of respectability, like trying to normalise staff performance under a bell curve. So why do these things? Because in order to make predictions, HR have been forced to try and report the same way finance does, using simple top-line metrics. But finance can create these metrics because most of their system is compressible. HR's isn't. That's good news though. Even though HR is a complex system, we can still use people information to model and predict behaviour. Kind of like we do with the weather. First, make sure you record interactions and context as part of your performance review. Then roll all of that great detailed information up in a way that allows you to identify patterns over time and make predictions. You'll need a killer performance management system for that.